In this video, we will do some interesting things called old photo restoration. Now this process takes a lot of time and patience. This video has three major steps. 1. Remove blemishes from the photo. 2. Color change and fix lighting. 3. Turn black and white to colorize. So watch this video till the end to know the complete process of old photo restoration step by step. Hey guys, Dave here from Affinity Vibe YouTube channel. First, zoom in and check those sensitive areas that need to be repaired with more care. This one is very sensitive area. Scratches between eyes, nose and lips. Now add a new pixel layer. Select in painting brush, set this brush current layer and below. Zoom in and paint gently on the blemishes to remove them. Use brush hardness 0 or 50% depending. Keep painting on each blemishes like this. Sometimes use a long stroke or short stroke. Sometimes one click or small click. And yes, use bracket keys on the key every time to adjust the size of the brush and keep painting gently. Use Ctrl Z, undo. Ok, the main area face part is done. Now from here I am going to fast forward this video and will come back after I remove all blemishes from this photo. Keep watching and keep doing the same steps repeatedly.
all right this is before and after now you are going to do some color adjustment and fix image lighting go to adjustment hsl reduce saturation and make it black and white use levels Feel free and check those level slide bars. Select all layers and put them in a group folder by Ctrl G. Right click and merge visible as make it in one layer. Now use this filter called haze removal. This will remove any fog or haze on the image. This is before and after. Now use some sharpness. Go to filter, unsharp mask and feel free to check it. Now if you want to keep your image as in black and white then go to file export and save it as jpeg format. Now in addition I want to make this image colorize. A few years back we have only one option take a pen tool select each part of the image add a new layer and put color on it. That process takes a few hours to complete one single black and white photo to color. But things have changed a lot nowadays. Thanks to technological improvement and AI process. We can colorize an old black and white photo now in one click. To do so, go to Google page, type image colorizer. Now this link is HTTPS secured side and the official site. Click left one AI colorizer. I already uploaded a detailed video on how to use this online AI auto colorizer. Then use Affinity Photo for color grading. You can check this video in this channel playlist. Anyway, click and upload or drag and drop your black and white photo. This one is our current black and white photo after restoration. Click start and wait for a few minutes. Now click on the download options. Now things need to understand about this colorizer done in auto AI process. So this is not a perfect one, but still better and saves a lot of time. In short, something is better than nothing. Save it. Back to affinity photo, bring this new color photo and let's do some color grading. Go to adjustment, HSL. Pick red to reduce some saturation. Then click on yellow, reduce some saturation. Now you do not need to follow the same step because here this image had a more red and yellow color. So I am reducing only red and yellow color. But 
if your image have more green or any other color then reduce the saturation of those colors i hope you get the point like this click on the blue and increase some blue saturation use white balance use levels Use color balance Use shadows and highlights right click and merge visible as make it in one layer use filter haze removal now this is black and white photo after restoration and this is black and white photo turn to colorizer before and after and that's it the complete process of old photo restoration step by step if you found this video helpful don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to my channel to get more amazing photo effect tutorials with affinity photo thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next video soon i'm dave from affinity vibe youtube channel